So as usual, I have paper, paint, a paper towel, my paintbrush, and my paint tray. Now if I am mixing two colors together, or if I'm painting with two colors, I have to be careful of, to clean my brush in between getting my paints. So if I get some red, again, I'll paint it as usual, clean around my paper. Now let's say I want some yellow. If I just put my brush in the yellow, I might end up getting some red in there. So if I went back and forth, I'd mix all these colors up. My colors would change. And I would ruin them. Ooh, see I got some red in there. So instead of doing that, if I want to change my colors, let's say I want some yellow now, I have to clean my brush first. So I'm going to go swish. Not tap it. I'm going to wipe it. Wipe. And then blot it on my paper towel. If you are mixing colors together, we can use a plate. So you can get a whole bunch of one color. Maybe you come into your paints here and you get yourself a scoop of red, put some red on your paper, or I mean on your plate, get a little bit more, get some more red. Okay, now if I want some yellow, I have to clean my brush first. So I can clean my brush, I swish it, I wipe it, and then I blot it. And then I can get some yellow, I get some yellow on my brush, I'll put it on my plate. And then using my plate, I can mix up the color that I want. So if I think, ooh, yes, I like that orange, I can use this orange and put it on my plate, or on my paper, I mean, and then paint that on there. Now let's say I want it to be more yellowy, so I clean my brush, swish it, wipe it, blot it, I'll come back in here and get some more yellow, and I can add some more yellow to this and get, oh yeah. I like that too, makes it more of a light orange, more of a yellow orange, and I can paint that on my paper. Okay, so this is great for mixing colors together and not mixing them in the containers.